Hey everybody, this is Wobblefox from the future. So I was editing the video and I noticed that the camera, uh, the one that I'm using right now, it didn't uh, record properly uh, for this episode and it seems to have affected my previous episode as well. So in episode 12, my camera just froze as I was recording. And I, I couldn't see that because right here in this little screen down here where I can see the recording, as I can see it now, everything was recording fine. Uh, it looked like it was normal. Uh, and episode 12, I didn't realize there was an issue until near the end when it had frozen when I was editing and for episode 13 I noticed there was an issue straight away because it didn't encode properly so whatever Elgato issue software issue whatever happened I don't know it looked fine when I was recording I didn't see any issues so for this episode apologize it won't be in my face there at all uh, it will just be sound so maybe for some of you might prefer it just to have the sound and you don't want to look at my ugly face but it's fine um, so yeah, just want to let you know that there won't be a recording or anything like that of me in the episode. So I'm hopefully have it fixed for, you know, later episodes, 14, 15 and so on. Uh, so yeah, just want to let you know guys. So yeah, I hope you enjoy the episode and goodbye. Welcome back, everybody. This is uh, Wobble Fox. We are playing Cyberpunk 2077. Uh, for me, it was maybe about 10 minutes since the last episode. For you, maybe it's a day, week, two weeks, a month. I don't know, depending on how I feel of uploading these. Uh, so yeah, uh, we had a really nice and smooth run uh, for the last recording. So I'm hoping it's going to stay the same. We're still in the game, in essence, the same run as previous episodes, so we're still here. So hopefully like, the frame rate stays consistent, everything is good, because I had a really nice smooth run last time. Uh, last time we finished up, I think, pretty much everything. Yeah, yeah we've, we've cleared up everything. Here we are. Yeah, we got everything. So we're just going to do some main missions now. Uh, so I think what we're going to do first, let's go to the afterlife as it's on the way, and then we're going to do the side mission, and then we're going to do Lizzie's bar after that one there. Uh, so let's go. Yeah, I'm, I'm so happy not having frame rate issues. I'm so happy it's smooth again. Because one, patch 1.2 absolutely ruined the game, uh, technically. And, but it seems either 1.21 or 1.22 fixed it all. So I'm really, really happy. Yeah, there's a bit of slowdown, but like instead of dropping to 15, it drops down to 40 or 50 uh, FPS. You know, like completely playable smooth mostly smooth and i could still notice a little bit of difference simply because it's uh jumping from really high frame rate like you know like 80 or 100 fps down to like 40 or 50 so i could still see the change in the slowdown and so on you know not a slight stutter but, but in general it's really really good what now Call back up heads hey, hey. you go Right. Uh, we need to talk to Rogue. Okay. No, this trouble, the net around me, you wove it. You know it. I lost everything. Let me be you. plain again. Solve your own problems. Clean you up your own what, shit. Go fuck yourself. Be careful who you bargain with. All right. Well, she's not happy. Need to fix her. Got something that can't wait. Let her in. I actually can't remember what this conversation is going to be about, but I'm guessing this is part of the main mission. Hmm. Not here. Not there. Who are you? Name's V. And what is it you want, V? All right. All these years, and it's really her. Fucking bro, just kicking it back on a couch at the afterlife. Oh, so he knows her. Don't mess with her. She's got MRI. See right through you. Give her the truth. The girl. What was her grade? Why don't you ask her? Might still be around, sniveling in a corner. All right. Need your services. Got to track a guy down. Mm-hmm. Anders Hellman. Hotshot engineer, worked for Arasaka. All right. Millisec. Anders Hellman. Pinpoint him for me. <laughs> Thanks. Jump in too soon. First, my help's got a price. Second and third. Dexter Deshawn, Jackie Wells, Tebo. Multiple bells ringing, V. Left a lot of bodies. Oh, yeah, they all died, didn't Death they? Death walks in your wake. Uh, 
chalk that up to bad luck. How did T-Bug die? There's the bitch I know. Ask her about Sokka Tower. How they shot me up right in front of her. Wanna go through old bits? Really? <laughs> Fine. Johnny Silverhand. Zeroed inside our Sokka Tower. Before your very eyes. Got more if you want. Or we could just Thanks, Johnny. That was really nice. On you, girl. Don't like that on every woman, but they seem to suit you. Anyways, feelings be damned, I've always said. This is pure biz. You need my help, so get those eddies ready. Mm-hmm. See? 15,000. We have enough. Should be enough. Mm-hmm. Come back tomorrow. We'll talk. All right. So we need to come back. All right. Well, she better not jump out on us. Oh, we just wait. Uh, should we wait? You know what? I don't want to wait. I I, I want to come back to this. So we talked to Rogue. So we initiated that quest line to find Helmen, Hel Helmets, Helsman. <laughs> um. Oh, there's something we can pick up here. Oh, nice. Uh, wrong direction. I want to get out of here. Uh, and I can't sprint in here. Uh, this way is out, I think. All right. Yeah, yeah, we're good, we're good. So yeah, so I think we're just gonna wait later. Uh, I can't be able to do that right now, but at least we initiated that. I, it, it reminds like at least it, I remembered what we we're doing. So this is part of uh, finding the guy who might be able to to give us some technical advice about what's going on. Right. So. Uh, we're going to leave that then, and we're just going to do the side mission with Barry. So we need to check on his. That should hopefully clear up uh, that side mission. Oh, wait, I can just fast travel, can't I? Because uh, there are ways. Uh, yeah, you can use these points to fast travel, but I feel like if I, by the time I get to a point and I click on it, you know what? Might as well just drive there. Now that the game is mostly smooth. Why don't we just drive and enjoy the drive? Yeah, the worst we're getting is about 35. Oh, oh, oh! <laughs> oh, no. oh, yes! <laughs> oh, I, should, I really get carried away talking, don't I? As I said, like, lowest we get is about 35 FPS when we're driving really fast, but. It's still an improvement over 15 or whatever it was when we were doing before, so I'm all good. I'm still checking the frame rates, like, it's still in my head. Uh, it keeps me paranoid. But it's much better, no issues. Uh, services. What the hell? Foreign body, it's all your own risk. BD. It looks like Mayrin's Dagon. Ford. Found? In 2017, oh, I didn't read it in time. Oh, these adverts are really cool. I'm not gonna lie, they're they're really really cool. Oh, everything's so empty. Uh, I think it is nighttime though, isn't it? I explain why. That's a cool bag. What? I'm sorry, okay? What? <laughs> what the fuck happened here? Mendez. It's too late. He can't hear you. What the fuck? <laughs> Your genes were fine, Barry. You were the strongest son of a bitch I knew. I'm so... I'm so sorry, Barry. Did I fuck something up? Sorry. Uh, Get out of here. Did I fuck something up with that guy? Did I give him the wrong advice? And they despawned. Got 
thing I can do. That's it. That's that, that's it. Right? So that was the guy that was really depressed about, you know, some of the stuff that was going on. He couldn't handle being a police officer, right? I have to say, like, that voice acting, the, like, the way he was saying it, sorry and stuff, that was really, really good. That was really good. That was really, depre like, depressing, but, like, it was really good. That was fairly well voice acted, I think. Uh, like, he really felt sorry. That was really good. But, like, I, f I, feel, I feel really bad because now I'm thinking, like... Did I say? Did my character say something wrong? Like I felt I was giving him the correct advice, but maybe I, maybe I did say something wrong. So, uh, or something else happened um, that was out of my control. Maybe I'm not sure right now. So that well, well that was a depressing note, wasn't it? Um, well, why don't we do this instead? Why don't we just go to this one first? Let's clear out a couple of things here. And, uh, oh no, we did say we we're going to Lizzie's bar. Let, let's go to Lizzie's bar. Let's do that. And then, uh, because I did say we we're going to do that first. So let's do that. Ooh, is there something I can pick up from here? Hey, there's from the there. very first stages of food production, uh, we bring you barbecue uh, quality that hell? even Mother Nature can empty. Forward march! Try out our freshly developed Sugar, whatever. Tastes, and let your tongue be amazed. All All right. Don't forget your worth. Spray painting and stuff, fair enough. Bottoms up, how it feels to to be on top. Set sail for flavor. Got another right. <laughs> like I, because I, I haven't really looked at all the adverts that closely, but like some of them, are, they, some of them seem really weird. The administrators of implant authorization are now the manufacturers, guided by the standards they. Alright, how much money do we have? Uh, 44k. All right. Thank you for joining all of us here at So I'm thinking, let's clear up. Let's go to see Lizzie. Uh, oh, we can call Judy optional. Who the fuck was Judy? Uh, Judy, Judy, Judy. Uh, you know what? Let's just do the optional thing. We're going to do the optional thing. Of course. Let's get out of the elevator and then we're going to call her. There we go. Right. Uh, Regina Jones, she sent me a message. All in. I got a call from Jacob Lamb, blah, blah, blah. I'm not going to read that. Uh... But I do want Takemura. Why am I calling him? I did not mean to call him. I want, I want to see the message from him. Uh, By vision without action is a dream. Action without vision is a nightmare. We should remember this. Uh, sure, whatever you say, mate. I really do not care. Um, okay. So what I want. But I want to call Judy. I want to call Judy. Judy. Oh yeah, yeah. There she is. That's that you? Shit. Thought you were gone. You're not alone in thinking me dead. Thought it was game over. Things went as up, huh? Not as planned. Well, yeah. <laughs> That's kind of guess. Heard about the heist? I take it. Must have. Hmm. Talked to Evelyn. Didn't need to. Whole damn city's hurt. Damn. Listen, need to find Evelyn. I really don't want to talk about her. Know where she is? What I just say. Drop it. I won't tell you again. Judy, you're my one hope. The only lead I got. I gotta find her. It's and true. I know you can help me do that. Who told you I won't? Can we meet? Let's meet, please. You at Lizzie's? Meet with Judy. Okay, so by calling them, it cleared up. Alright, alright, let's come in here. I wonder if they're not going to let me in now. They might not let me in. I might be in like the blacklist or something now. Let's see. Yes, you have. Got a good memory for faces. Here for a good time. Need to talk to Punch and Judy. She in her den. 
Yep. All right, let's go. Take the stairs down. I'll let Judy know you're coming. My, what a sweet little face you have. Oh, she said the same thing the last time we came in. What a sweet little face you have. Wish this is something else. That's fine. Doesn't matter. Uh, blah, blah, blah. Doesn't matter about everyone's armed. Uh, fuck to death. Great. Um, how did we go downstairs? These are bathrooms. Keep the lights on in here. Oh, this way. Where are you going? Nothing to see back here. Let it lie. Judy's friend. Exactly, bitch. <laughs> Anything else we can pick up here? There we are. We can get that. Ooh. Yeah, we can get that as well. Nice. It's kind of cool. Like you, you walk into these, they really do move around. Nice bit of physics. Will they stop though? That's the question. Will they stop? They are slowing down, I think. Yeah, they're slowing down. Will they stop though? They're still moving a lot. In real life, they would have stopped by now. They might vibrate a little bit, but they would have stopped. They're still going. But they have slowed down. Yeah, they will eventually stop. They will stop eventually. There we go. Um, yeah, they're almost stopped. Fair enough. What's this? Moxie's blah 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 fuck something. Alright. Let's go down. I wonder if she's gonna point a gun in our face. Stop telling every joy toy you need to come here. The hell I'm supposed to do with them all? You're so concerned about strays? Go take care of your guests. Susie Q, who the hell is she? Suze, we're not done here. Oh yeah, we fucking are. Alright, I don't know who the hell she is, but whatever. Maybe we'll have to help her out with something before she talks to us. You just don't give up, do you? Of course not. Uh, nothing more to say to each other. That, that your boss? Susie seems to know what she wants. She your boss? Yes. You come all this way just to play who's who at the mocks? Uh, what was that all about? God's sake, I have to use this one. Uh, what was that all about? What was that all about? Everyone in this city lives in their own goddamn bubble. And either you fly high or sink into quicksand. I want to sink right now. Listen, have you seen Evelyn? Need to talk to her. It's important. Why? So you can make her your scapegoat for your train wreck of a heist. Bitch, please. Need to find out who she was I'm, working for. I think that's the cool... That's um, I, I think that's the it. yin yang Judy, is the cool attribute. And I think that's what we Wouldn't make got. sense. Fine. Alright. Evelyn's a doll. Used to work at Clouds. All right. Sig case on my table's got the address. Take it, and once you find Evelyn, give it to her. Mega Tower. <laughs> Luxurious. Sure. Can we talk to her about anything else? Can we get upgrades here? You still need something? Uh, okay. Wait, mean to say she's a doll? Hmm. Saved up for that behavior chip a while, too. Ev was good. Real good. Had regulars booked up weeks in advance. Nobody lasts long in a gig like that, though. Right. Hence the heist figures. A doll? Well, I'm guessing like a prostitute that? or something, or what? It's a dollhouse. Sounds vaguely familiar. That where they tailor code things to your fetishes and whatnot? Client subconscious is the script. Right. Doll stars in it. Oh, I see, I see. No memory of it after, though, luckily. So it's like Thank Christ a mind God. prostitute. <laughs> Like in your mind. Think she might have gone back there? Said it'd be safer than here. God knows why. So I'm guessing Got for her. For yeah, I'm guessing like if your mind gets wiped the all place. the time, it's probably not going to be good for your brain. Uh, yeah, we're good. Wait. Um. Just let me know how she's doing. So she clearly cares. She's a friend and stuff, I'm guessing. Give you a call. Okay. Thanks. Thank you, V. Look, it wasn't my fault that the heist went fucked up. Who the hell knew that like, the son is going to kill his daddy? Because some daddy issues. 
Why am I not surprised? You're an engram and a fading mind. Nothing should surprise you anymore. So we're gonna hit this place, Clouds? Yeah. Why the hell not? Where is it though? Gonna say anything else? You're just gonna stand there. Oh, you're just gonna stand there. Let's go. Think I just woke up one day looking like this? Oh. What the hell? It's hard work. What are you staring at? Got something to say? Say it. Who the hell are you? Ooh, tech ability. Uh, heated exchange there with Judy. What was that all about? How's this any of your business? Gonna follow up with your own sermon on responsibility for others? Go on. Your high horse is waiting. I'm just curious. One thing I know about curiosity won't get you shit unless you got the fists and the ass to back it up. Know what happened to Evelyn Parker? Why are you asking me? You talked to Judy about her already. Sure, but you're the boss. Might know something more. Evelyn jumped the mock ship a long time ago. All right. And anyone not a mox is not my damn problem. So it's like a gang thing, all right. Guessing the club brings in a lot of biz. Pisses its share a cost, too. Why, looking to invest? No, just admiring your operation. We took over this place way back when. Every day I wake up and wonder how it's still standing. We get by, that's all I'll say. All right. So they do like stuff on the side Heard and you so give on. the working girls a helping hand. Yeah, well, yeah, we overheard some that's of that. That's history. And like all history, it was pretty damn bloody. Oh. What was it? Something about a riot? Oh, okay. I thought it was something else because I remember we overheard like some people talk about the first. like helping the out with a daddy or something. Folk went ballistic. This is something else. All right. With raised fist. Girls, pimps, outcasts, the whole freak show. It's how the mocks got started. But that's old news. We're running a business now, not a charity. Makes sense. Can't help everyone in this city. Gotta take care of our own. Moxes come first. That's right. It's like it's like a gang mentality. I'm guessing, like you know, you, you just, you just uh, do this and that. Heated exchange there with Judy. Yeah, we already talked. What about. was that all about? How's this any of your business? Uh, Gonna follow up with your own. Blah 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 blah. Yeah, we already went through all that. Let's go. Forget Evelyn. Admit it. This is about Judy's virtues. All right. Answer, Mr. Hans. Who the hell is Mr. Hans? Call me Mr. Hans. Sure. If you're looking for Pacifica jobs, call me. Name's V. And what? No pleas to meet you? Hmm. I'm truly honored to meet you. You got any biz? Call me. Is he a fixer or something? Right. So we got a, so we got a new message. If you call me, it's it's to talk biz. I don't chit chat. All right. Uh, so we've got quite a few people on our little, uh, little phone list, contacts. All right. Um, that's fine. Okay, so this takes us to all the way here. Uh, go to the mega building. Wakaka. So I'm just trying to figure out what area to do next. And I feel like I want to do north rather than south. Um... Um, I'm not sure. We can talk to Takemura. Because we've done what I said I wanted to do, which was we... I guess we could just go back and wait for her. So, you know what, we might as well do it. And then we can leave this area of the city and go to another area properly. So let's do that. Maybe we can clear out a few more side missions. Uh, why is there like a traffic jam there? Shouldn't take long to get here. It's only yeah, we are. we drain quite fast. It should be fine. Can we get around it? There we go. Ooh, nice. Ah, my brakes are not good enough. <laughs> oh, there's a fight. There's like a shootout there. Someone's shooting.
Okay, let's uh, let's leave it here. Let's uh, let's go and do it. We we'll wait. We'll wait for uh, Rogue, and uh, we'll see what she's got to say. And I'm guessing it'll take us to a different part of the city anyway, and we'll see where it takes us. Because I do want to go to the north. So I do want to do that. Okay, so let's wait. Right. Sometime later. Here to see Rogue. Expect to me. Hey Rogue, I'm back. What about Helmet? Two, please. Make some room. Sit down. All right. Hope you found him. Don't see that often. Determination like yours. You must really need this guy. Matter of life and death. <laughs> Haven't heard that for a while either. Bottle stays. Go ahead. Enjoy. Thanks, but I'll pass. Hell's wrong with you. Good stuff. Your loss. <laughs> no one likes that. I don't drink. It's fine. <laughs> Thanks, Nix. Queen of the afterlife. Who would have thunk? Got thunk? a shard for you. Fort. Intel. Interesting stuff. Uh, take a chip. See what you got. How many chips can we put in our head anyway? Your helmet's not on any payroll, not officially anyway, but he does pop up in GNT's confidential stacks. Right. It's a Kang Tao subsidiary, Chinese Corp. Kang Tao's been using them as a fig leaf for years. They're masked for more sensitive operations. All that clear? Must be prepping him for a transfer. How would you know? Chinese Corporal playbook's an open one to me. This looks like the old vanishing pigeon. Decrypted map of upcoming Kang Tao convoy routes. Think right. Hellman might be in one of them? Thing is, which one? Take a look at the specs on this one. A lone AV, no ground support, no linked cargo manifests either. Weird. Sure, Kang Tao sometimes transports stuff unregistered if they want to push it under the table, but catch the load on this AV. Already approved in the system, but too low. So definitely no cargo on board. Huh. But there's a passenger list. Kang Tao security detail plus one VIP. Transfer from Chan T. Our boy Hellman. That was the good news. What's the bad there news? There it is. Data's all confidential. You just snap your fingers and it falls in your lap. I know where to look, and I know whose head to put in a vice. All right. Also, hate wasting time, especially answering stupid questions. So what's the bad news? Bad news is the extraction site. Look, Night City airspace. All this. Uh huh. No way to jack the transport without the NCPD picking up. I'm guessing up they on fly. It. And here, we're too close to Kang Tao. We even give that AV a dirty look. Their backup hustle will be on us. But right here's Jackson Plains, narrow corridor just outside the city. And so we need to actually go outside Kang the city. That's kind of cool. It's your lucky day. A dead zone. I'll grab him there. Gonna need a native to the area. Someone who'll set up the op, cobble together the gear. Even tracking that AV will be a bitch. Familiar with the type. Saw legacy models flying around during the war. The war. They're mammoth, but they're quick. Plus, they pack next-gen defenses. Can't take pot shots at it. Not even with serious That's a lot of. Power. Just won't work. It's a lot of mention of like why the law, like the war, there and like things that happened before. But it's like the problem or is. At least improvise on a theme. It doesn't really explain much of it. It just so mentions it. Like your your my own character that I'm playing one. knows more Anna than I do. Palmer. And it's really annoying. She can't count on her clan anymore, but she's a because I don't really know. She knows those lands. Because when my character mentions and something, it's like, well, I don't know about this. Won't have a choice. Won't have a choice. Maybe if I read some of the or codexes and bits we find her, around, maybe, but enticing even so, comes like, at a price you can't possibly afford. <sighs> can't possibly afford to blow this chance at Nabin Hellman. Your operation, your call. 
got a bad feeling. I wish I, I wish she explained a bit more of the background, but doesn't matter. Strange. The nomads give the city and city folk a wide berth. Varies by clan, by the connections they have, the depth of shit they're in. But you're right. Reminds me of Crisis. All the Caldos are rarely willing to do biz with the city. <laughs> Pan Am's got a different take. Yep, on everything it seems. Why is Pan Am gotta help me? I sense a catch. Pretty big one. Occasionally, Pan Am moves merch for me. Last job? Well, wasn't a good day for her. She ran into a hitch. Complete bust, actually. Lost the goods and her ride. Oh, Pan Am, the, Pan that's the girl uh, to get the load back. that was arguing with her dignity. when we came in last time. Alright. Okay. It's just a lot of people and a lot of random to jargon her, to keep track of. Look, I mean, we do. Because they just introduce a character and it's like, oh, I have no idea who this person is, and suddenly they're important or something. You know, but wouldn't tell Pan Am. Aim to play cat and mouse with me too. My aim is to know an opportunity when I see one, and then to seize it. Say I told her everything. What do you think she'd have done? Grabbed her iron and gone on the warpath. That's what. Not hard to see how that could end it. And there's nothing I hate more than losing good people to plain stupidity. Oh, that's fair. I'm her only chance, and she's my only chance. Two pawns on Rogue's board. You're quick. For a pawn. No, oh, V. Fine, let me hear what you know. Rocky Ridge, ghost town just outside Night City. Pan Am knows where. You'll go there, get the merch back. Wheels too. Naturally, you'll call her first. Sending you her deeds. Ah, oh, finally. Let's I'll get clear. out of here. Thanks. Good luck. All right, cool. That's that set up. Uh, we need to call Pan Am. Hang on just a little longer, oh. Chu. Ripper's on the way. I, I can't. Hey, Pan Am. Got your number from Rogue. You can see. Great. Where's that old Morbus want to kick me now? What do you mean you're not coming? You're coming, dog. You'll be here in five minutes flat or... Fuck! This thing between you and Rogue. Couldn't care less. Oh, wow, something happened Got a here. job for you. Good. But I'm overextended at the moment. With the merch in your car? <laughs> getting him oh, back? Oh, wow. I can help with that. The rail freight yard on Benita Street. The one hugging the city line. We'll meet there. See okay, so we, we've got our rendezvous position with her. Cool. Nice. Meet with her. Uh, we'll see if it's anywhere where we want to go. I really wish I could sprint here, but I really can't. It's so annoying. Ah! No. Where the hell is. Oh, it's that way. All looks kind of the same here. It's a bit annoying. What the hell? How do I get out? Not this way. Right, right. We talk to. Let's pick up those. Oh yeah, that's my bad. We need to go this way. My bad. Okay. Can I sprint yet? Oh come on. Yeah, I wish you didn't disable sprint. Um, this is a bit annoying. Meet with Pan Am. So let's find out where do we actually meet her. Ooh, that's far away. So now I need to make a decision what we're gonna do because a lot of the a lot of these missions are taking us elsewhere. This is quite a big space, isn't it? There's a lot of stuff going around here. Wow, there's loads of stuff. Damn. Um, I really want to get, like, I feel like if I get the north areas done, there's not a lot going on here. Like, there's really not a lot of stuff, side quests and stuff. So I feel like if we can clear out some of the side quests here, and maybe get that tarot card there, and then we can move in to here and do the missions as we go along. And that'll be a, that'll be a lot of side missions uh, cleared out. And then we don't have to mess around with things as much. 
So that's what I think what we're gonna do. Because I, I just wanna get like some of these side objectives going. Let's get some levels, get let's get a bit some pieces done. Uh, maybe we can see some interesting stories like side missions and stuff. So why don't we do that? Why don't we go do this objective first? And that one there as well. Uh, we also need to call our car. Because a lot of stuff is taking us south, but hopefully we can... But I do want to get some more levels, I want to get a few more skill points and things. Because I think we can go all the way to like level 50 in this game. So that'd be pretty awesome. Uh, car, where the hell are you? Oh yeah, there you, there you are. Let's go, let's go, let's go. And you are repaired, fantastic. Let's get in. Let's do this. Uh, oh, you're telling me to go in two different directions. What's faster? Um, one is very direct. And very straight road. We'll take the yellow road. We'll go... We'll go to the main server first, and then we'll do the side objective. They seem fairly close by. It should be fine. Oh, it's so nice not to have this stupid lag. It's so nice to drive. Like, we can actually look around. We can... Go at full speed, it's so nice not to have the lag, it actually feels good to play. Like yeah, it's not 60 FPS as I'm doing this, it's about 40, but like, it's nice. It feels good. Slow down a bit here, but we were going really fast, but it's still like, it's still above like 30. So, what the hell is that car doing? We can actually drive through, that is so nice. Like, now I'm enjoying the game. Like, we can drive, we don't need to worry about things. Just really, really nice and smooth. Uh, oh, yeah, remember there's like some police stuff here. Doesn't matter. We'll just ignore it. Maybe I should start using the fast travel bit points though. And he just walked through my door. Uh, wait, so that's only 50 meters away. Why don't we clear it out? Because I'm guessing this guy is Japanese. All right. Yeah, let's clear this out. Let's just do it, uh, and then we do the side mission. Uh, I can actually stealth here. Dump her somewhere? Yes, I can. In here. Easy peasy, right? Okay. Oh, there's loads of guys down here. Oh, shit. I don't know if I'll be able to sneak up on her without being detected though. And I don't think there's a way to jump up. Okay, because this, this could go really crazy, so we're gonna save. Because we haven't saved in ages actually. We haven't actually saved since the last episode, so... I know there's auto-saves, but we haven't done the manual one. Okay, she's moving, she's moving, she's moving. Pick up body. Can I dump her silently? Or will she catch me if I dump her? She made a lot of noise, but she didn't do anything. I'm gonna kill you as well. I like her haircut. Anyway, but you're dead. And now I'm gonna pick up. And I think I can dump her in the same spot. Yeah, I can dump her. And there's no one else inside. So the, the previous NPC despawned. So you can literally dump. So this is not like Metal Gear Solid or something like that. Where, like Metal Gear Solid 5, like it, you can only dump one person in one area of space. Because there's only enough space for one person. I think maybe, maybe two people in one or two places you could do that. But here, like you can just dump them infinitely into the same spot if you wanted to. Uh, K. 
Kevin Kelvin Clark. Okay. Uh, they might not see me if I actually go for this guy. Maybe I can take down this big guy. Without them seeing me. I think I can. Are you kidding me? I actually can do that. He's so big and I can carry him. <laughs> Jesus. There's, like, you need to have something hard to Look, he's so big. There's no way you'd have the strength for that. Like, just casually, like, just lifting up. Ah, uh, cockadoodle. Should be okay, should be okay. Okay, we need to get around them. <sighs> I could... Oh, is this where we need to be? Come on. Yeah, we go, there we go, there we go. Uh, I think we're gonna have to kill the rest though, aren't we? I don't think there is a way. No, <sighs> actually. Maybe there is. Kill her. What the hell did she do that? What the hell happened there? Headshot. No. Headshot. Done. I think that's done, right? Yeah, I think that's it. Oh, you're carrying too much. Let's quickly uh, get rid of all this stuff. So this is where I, I'll probably just uh, edit edit through this so we don't have to watch everything. There we are. We're back. Uh, so we just changed the scope to this uh, for new assault rifle with a new scope. This scope looks really nice. I like to be able to see my field of vision better. So this is really, really nice. Uh, and it's the same sniper rifle. So we just uh, disassemble some stuff. You know, that sort of thing. Uh, I think we clear this area, right? I don't think there's anything more we can do. Uh, these people are in fear. But I think they were being held hostage anyway. Okay. Right. I think that's it. Is this the assault, right? That is not the assault. So what the hell did I do? Oh, it's up there. Oh, I see, I see. Just need to pick up some stuff from him. Alright, cool. Done. Now it's done. Now it's done. Ooh. I can turn off power. I don't know what it switched the power off to, but whatever. Uh, right, so that's done. Uh, now we're going to go um, do the last bit here, which is this. It's already directing me now, right? Let's put away our weapon. Uh, oh, alright, we're going in here then. What the hell is that advert? Wet dream, be the dream. <laughs> Jeez. Uh, I'm guessing server room? There's a lot of like sex adverts on there. A lot of like sex and uh, weird bits and pieces. I guess it's about. I guess, I guess Cyberpunk is about. At least in this universe, it's a lot about sex, you know, body modification, you know, transhumanism, all those sort of themes. Oh, I can finally pick those up. I think one of the, Did the hotfix finally allow me to pick up some of these things that I wasn't able to pick up before? If that's the case, that's brilliant. Because I haven't been able to pick up those at all. Alright, so we switch that off. Pick up things. Any more cameras? Nope. 
upload uh, bad malware to the system. So we need to get there. This looks like a big space. Probably a lot of enemies. Surveillance camera, turn off. There's a dump thing there. Oh, shit. Did I see more than one person there? Careful. Glendale. Is there one person? Is there someone else there? Okay, if I can get this guy. Dressed up half of block D. Ah, this is you up with my cousin. Looking for people I for a blood bag. Shit. Oh, I guess we're doing all doing this the way. Oh, I fucked it up. I fucked it up. I was about to grab him. Oh, this is a fully automatic rifle. All right. There we go. Oh, you know, why the hell am I doing stealth? This is so much more satisfying. Just if I can actually hit them. Jesus. My aim was way off. Uh, open the door. Open the door. Thank you. Ah, oh, that it feels good. Fully automatic feels so much better. Ah, oh, I'm getting hit though. All right, all right. Let's play this smart. Okay. Finally, someone I can fucking fight. But you run away, right? It didn't say we have to do this stealthily, did it? So I think this is ac acceptable. Uh, any computer we can access? No? Fine. Uh, let's just pick up everything quickly. No. Oh, I've got an idea. What if I pick him up? Yes. And can I dump him now? And will that train my stealth? No. What about him? No, it doesn't train my stealth because we fucked it up, right? Alright, that's fine. Okay. Oh. The person's in the... Um, they're unaware of their surroundings. So let's pick up everything before we upload. I think that's everything here, right? Can't pick up that though. Uh, let's go upstairs. So I want to clear out the area. Just, I don't want to have any nasty surprises. Yeah, this is where we came in. Yeah, yeah. So that's it, right? That's it. Cool. Uh, and yeah, we just upload the malware. guessing we're doing here. I want to use it first. Oh, there's nothing here. I thought there's something you can do. Okay. There's no messages or no files or anything here. We just upload it. There we go. Leave the server room. Does anything happen to her? No, nothing happens to her. All right. I thought she mean she might die or something or something. She maybe goes crazy or something. But no. No change. All right, let's get out of here. The force open. Sweet. Uh, there we go. Messages sit tight. Leaving out litter. Local network. Turn off. All right, we we didn't really need to do that anymore. Uh, we already did it manually. It's fine. Uh, upstairs. It's good. Yeah, catch a tiger's eye, yeah, yeah. So we're done with that, right? We just need to leave the server room. Once we're out, that'll be complete and we can move on to the next thing. 
Yeah, we still got like another 15 minutes. We can do some things. Cool. Yeah, done. That's happy, which means I'm happy, which means you get your eddies and everyone's happy. Contract closed. Thanks, V. Okay, we're done. That's cool. Uh, we're not going to go to Mega Building H8. Yeah, I know it defaults to whatever we're doing. Oh, level up. Sweet. Uh, reflexes. Assault is 8. Cool. And if uh, I'm, what I'm looking at is you, you can see stealth and cold blood. So. I think I explained this in another episode as well, uh, because I, un unless you uh, unless you already know it, but uh, in essence, these can't level above your actual overall attributes. Your attribute determines the maximum any of these can level to. So for technical ability, I can't get them above seven. Here I can't get them above nine, and here I can't get these above uh, six. Although I'm pretty terrible at all of them, so we're not going to put any more into that. We, uh, you see, breach protocol is actually maxed out there. Uh, but because we use Assault a lot, it's already at 8, it's close to 9, I'm guessing. Uh, where is it? Assault. Yeah, Assault is 69, oh, 69 nice. 69% uh, towards uh, the next level, so we're going to put it into Reflexes, uh, which gives us a few buffs, right? So uh, let's put that to 10. I, I think the maximum is 20 for any of these, so it's fine. Uh, do we want anything from here? Dark Hunter, handguns, we're not, blades, we're not doing. Uh, do we have anything? Not at the moment. Let's just keep putting it into cold blood for now. Oh, what's this? Oh, yeah, sorry, I already read that last time. Uh, yeah, why don't we finish getting the, acquiring this one? So now we have 5% recoil reduction per stack of cold blood. And cold blood stacks uh, as we kill, in essence, uh, which is really nice. So after defeating an enemy, gain cold blood for 10 seconds. Increase movement speed by 2% stacks up to 3 times at the moment, but you can actually increase the stacks, you can increase the duration. So we, the duration is increased by an, an extra 10 seconds, so it actually lasts for uh, 20 seconds for us. Uh, and then at the moment, we also now reduce weapon recoil, but we do want to get a few more of these ones eventually. So what I'm thinking is probably reflexes and cool will be maxed out, uh, and technical ability will get as high as we can, because I think we can get to level 50, so I think we have enough points to max out two of these, maybe two and a half of them. So we'll see, we'll see. I haven't, I haven't really done the calculation on it. I'm sure we can max out two of them for sure, but I don't know if we can max out any more than that. Uh, right, so let's get in our car and select our next destination. So I think, as there's not much going, like there's really not that many things to do. Like it looks like a lot of stuff, but I don't think it's going to take us that long. I mean, we already cleared this art out. Why don't we do the gift? Uh, retrieve the ping quick hat from the net runner. So we do that one, and then we go to this, and then we do this. There's like there's really nothing around here apart from this one here and then one there. So we really can clear out the, this north area very quickly because there's not a lot going on. So let's just get on with it. Less talking, more killing is what we're going to be doing. And I think once we're done in north, we'll just start working our way towards uh, a bit more south and actually doing some of the main story stuff. Because I just want to get some of this stuff out of the way. Get, get ourselves some levels, get ourselves some nice perks. So that when we do get into the main missions, we can just approach them for more variety of uh, ways rather than be stuck with just guns blazing. Maybe we can do a bit more stealth. Because we did do one, yeah, you know, it's just one, but we did do one mission uh, stealthily, successfully as well. So we can do it. It's just that uh, we just have to be careful. Oh, he's a, he's a big boy. I do like that they have a lot of body shapes. It's a shame that our character can't have different body shapes. Oh, okay. Uh, T Bug sent me. Oh. T Bug's death. What did you hear? The truth. She got burned, like anyone who tries to hit at us. That, that explains it. So she, I they guess, her brain the body blew up. in her pad. Nervous system yeah. fried. Because I was wondering you how she died. I thought she just. Like? I thought she just got like Can't killed the system that she actually died. Fair they enough. say it's like a hundred thousand knives stabbing you at once. I can't imagine a worse way to go. Poor girl. I liked her too. How's this work? 
Any punk off the street can waltz in here, grab some shady running soft? No, not just any punk. Over the counter, we fix cyber decks. But if you come recommended and you know what you are looking for, I'm sure you will find it. Okay. Uh, T-Bug sent me to grab a program. T-Bug sent me. Said you'd have something for me. So you are V. I'm sure you heard what happened. Real shame. Yeah, we just talked about it. <laughs> she left a demon for you. Ooh. A gift from beyond the grave. All right. It should work on any third gen deck. Fun. All right. Uh... Got a Militech Paraline. Think it'll do. Mm. Solid gear. For a beginner. Ooh, so fancy. All right, whatever. Okay. Glad to grab a demon always. You could test it now. Everyone's an elitist an with cyber point. stuff, right? If you'd like, that is. You might extract some shimsoft or subroutines. Seems worth a try, okay. either way. Uh Oh, I didn't actually mean to buy anything from her. Oh, we need to get this. Oh, it costs zero, though. So let's just get it. Um, we don't really need anything else. We don't really do a lot of hack quick hacks or anything. Right. The gift. Uh, limited ca capacity, blah, 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 blah. Uh, so inventory, cyberware. Is it cyberware we want? Uh, cyber deck. Oh, see? Like, the, the menu cuts off. So I can't actually says what it says. Install a quick hack on cyberdeck. To install a quick hack on your cyberdeck, you need to first select it from the list. Select a ping. Select the ping quick hack. It should then appear in a cyberdeck slot on the left side of your screen. Cyberware. Uh, available mods. I don't think it's any of these. Right. Is it in a cyberdeck? Ping, right, yeah. Uh, Sonic Shock, what's this? Sign ups, burn up, lethal, whatever, doesn't matter. Reveals enemies and devices connected to the local network. Fair enough. Uh, are we going to use it? I'm not sure. Um, but we're just going to disassemble these instead. Oh, new shoes. And they are a little bit better, so we are going to delete the old ones. There we go. That's it. Upload ping to the to the camera to find the access point. Okay. Uh, ping. There we go. Oh, I see. So now it shows us everything. Cool. Uh, hack it. Okay, so we need to jack in. Uh, once, oh, that's easy. 1C55. Uh, oh, that's not so easy. 1C. <laughs> I'm terrible. Uh, try again. Uh, yeah, yeah, sure. Uh, we need 1C55, then 1C... If we, yeah, we need to select that, don't we? Uh, 55... So we need... Yeah, so we do this 1C55, there we go. I'm still a bit unsure if, like, how many things I'm allowed to select that are wrong. But yeah, that's done. Cool. The gift is done. Uh, we can just jump down. Where's our car? Uh, this way. Alright, let's get in. Uh, next thing that we need to do. Alright, so that is done. Oh, we're not doing that one. Uh... That is a long way around. Why? Okay. Yeah, we will do this one here. All right. Cool. Let's go. Cool. Oh, it's right here. Introducing Alois de Camp. A deadbeat with a pretentious name. Gonk broke my trust and skipped town. Well, fuck him. Only thing I care about now is the data he left in NC. Specifically, what's on his comp. 
Check the attachment, you'll see what to do. Okay. Uh, there's multiple entrances, okay. I am the Hulk. Right, let's grab that. There's a guide there. Who the fuck saw me? Let's see. Oh, plus one perk points. Nice. Uh, I don't really care about that. I'm just worried about cameras, that's all. Okay, we scanned that person. Okay, there's another guy there. Can we take him out? Without alerting the other guys. No. Because somebody saw me. Who the fuck saw me? Who the fuck saw me? That's my question. There's someone there? In. Oh, I didn't, didn't realize we could just walk in this way. All right. We gotta find a way. Okay. Uh, we gotta find a way to do this. see me if I do something there. Joy toy. We need to get his laptop. Mm. I don't know. Alright, 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 he's moving that way. I should be able to get Can I dump him in there? It normally tells me if there's somewhere I can dump some. There's a dump there. There is one here. Right, nice. One down. Now we just need to uh, clear out some more. Of them. I don't know what she's doing, but whatever. She can't see us, and she's not alerting us. Uh, oh, come on! I don't want to jump all the way up. I picked up something. What the hell did I pick up? Was that not the mission? Okay, so the it, the hotfix doesn't doesn't let me pick up everything. Oh, oh, oh. Right, so there's someone there. Right. There's a guy this way. I can't kill him if he's... If he's just... Yeah, I can't kill him if he's just sitting down, can I? Apparently. Yeah. Now we can 
kill this guy. Right, that's that's all of them apart from the guy that's sitting down, right? Right, that's cool. So right, so let's dump these guys down. There we go, done. Um, random stuff we can pick up, blah blah blah. Get that, get that, get that. Uh, okay. uh, again, like a lot of these vinyl things we can't pick up. So I don't know if they're if there's like a are they sitting behind like the mesh or something? I don't know. For whatever reason we can't pick them up that well. Uh, okay. Now let's dump him as well. Uh, let's pick up Whoa, low floating bottles, floating things, alright. Uh, access to computer, message, do 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 kabuki net, uh, blah blah blah. It's not here. Yeah, so we just got that one guy to kill, uh, which we can do. Ooh! Oh, there are guys downstairs. Great, I didn't realize that. Ah, I fucked it up. I didn't realize there's. I didn't realize there was a downstairs area. I thought it was just at one level. Uh, I, I should. I should just get on my assault rifle. Oh, she doesn't even know what's going on. <laughs> All right, let's get this. Go be the fuck. Okay. Anyone else here? I think that's it. I think that's everyone, right? Yeah, that's everyone. Nice. Oh, purple. Right, that's got it. Got it, got it, got it. I really did not realize there was someone downstairs. Otherwise, I would have kept going really stealthy. And I would have ignored the sitting guy. Uh, but apparently, that's not the case. Who would have thought? Corpo or not, without Chrome, we all look like the same idiotic, bullet ridden sacks of meat. Uh, fair enough. Nice and uh, pleasant thoughts all around. Yeah, more loot. Loot, 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 loot first. Uh, deposit laptop in the drop point. Okay, so we already have the laptop. I didn't realize. Okay, uh, yep, that's everything. Hey, where'd you come from? Oh, it's just downstairs. Wanna talk about this? I don't know what you saw there. I don't go down there. I don't know anything. They forced me. I'm their hostage. Said if I try to escape, I'd be next on the table. I swear. No. Lying. It's your right not to believe me. You also have the right to a discount. Discount? What do you mean? Special prices for special customers. Mm, okay, what are you selling? In exchange Forgetting for... Forgetting what I saw in the basement? Yes. Well put. Well said. Mm, what the fuck does he sell, though? <sighs> Maybe he sells something good. I can kill sure. him anyway. Deal. Basement's already forgotten. Perfect. Glad to agree. Please, let me know if you need anything. So what does he sell? Cyberware. Kind of okay. stuff you got. I, I was guessing it's, got, it's gonna be cyberware, but uh, he might have something like because maybe he has something rare. That's why I didn't really know if I should kill him or not. Yeah, he's got some interesting stuff. Uh, but as I said, we're, we're not because like cyberware. Some cyberware can be really expensive. Like some of these are cheap, but like if we, I don't know, is there anything? Yes, this is like three k eight hundred uh, arms. Yeah, these are getting expensive. Like so that I, ha I haven't upgraded yet because I'm thinking like. I want to get a bit more money and then just 36,000, that would be most of our money. 
So, uh, double jump. Ah, I see, double jump would be quite nice. Um, we can only do one for the legs, though. We can only do one for the arms. What does this? Uh, projectile launch system. Uh, mono wire. Physical damage. I wonder why it changes the equipment. Uh, Mantis blades. Gorilla arms. So, oh, these are like Adam Jensen, like, uh, sort of Deus Ex sort of things, right? Uh, okay, so what is this? What is this? Uh, projectile launch system. Smart link cyberware required to enable smart targeting. The projectile launch, uh, launch allows you to unleash various powerful projectiles dealing various types of damage, blah, blah, blah. Uh, oh, it's like a rocket arm. It's like a rocket arm, I'm guessing. Uh, mono wire. What's this? Mono wire charges when equipped and not used in combat. Attacks with a charge wire deal bonus damage based on the charge level. Charge level and bonus damage dealt decline with each attack. Mono wire deals physical damage, deals a high amount of. Uh, right. Mantis blades are really cool. They look. Oh, I kind of want to try Mantis blades. Uh, blades inherent fast attack speed and combos. They can rapid de devastate and blah blah blah. But I, I don't know if I'm like. I don't know if I. How I feel about. Uh, Charge, uh, Gorilla Arms charge with each attack. When you perform a strong attack, they deal bonus damage based on the charge level. Gorilla Arms also allow you to force open locked doors and rip turrets from their bases. <sighs> I feel like because I want to, I want to be find a way so we can do the melee stuff. Does this help with us? I, uh, I heard that Gorilla Arms might help with that. So why don't we, you know, why don't, oh, fuck it. Why don't we try it? Confirm. Uh, but we don't have enough for the legs now. Been doing this year long? Two years, maybe more. Wasn't easy at first, but I made the right connections. Half the heavy lifting in business is the networking. This and the will to be cooperative and flexible. So he clearly knew what was going downstairs. On downstairs, he was just pretending he didn't. Uh, uh, I don't know. I think the double jump is probably more of what I would like to have. A nervous system, not sure, blah, blah, blah. Immune system, what's this? Increases all resistances by 8%. So, operating systems, blah, blah, blah. I would have to, like, compare. I would have to maybe look look into this, what, what I could, what I could and couldn't get. Um, I, I think I saw, did we see this? Yeah, like, we saw this in the uh, other, other shop as well, with the guy that we owed the money to. Um, that's fine, that's fine. Uh, but we don't have enough to purchase oh so we do have oh it does actually modify our body oh nice oh that's really, really cool Ooh. it does feel solid i like the sound oh i really like that maybe i made the right choice maybe the mantis blades was not what i wanted maybe this is what i wanted uh, 250 meters. Uh, let's run it. I could call my car, but we can just run it. It doesn't take long. Yeah, it's just right there. Come on. Uh, 100 meters. Come on. Uh, there we go. Uh, which way around do we need to go? Yeah, I think we'll get double jump. I think we'll get double jump. Uh, it sounds like something that could help us navigate a lot faster. Ooh, there's guys there. Uh, I feel like I want to kill them. It's so strange though, like, you literally have people like walking around like in normal office clothes. And at the same time you have like these gangster looking people like on the side. Exactly the tech I wanted. Thanks. Get closed. Fantastic, we've done it. Uh, I don't think I can line up two headshots, can I? Can I do it? I want to get that achievement. Ah! I have kids. Done it. Ooh, cold blood leveled up. Nice. 
Oh, very good, very good, very good. I think that was a nice ending. Because I think uh, I think it's time we end the episode, isn't it? But uh, that's really, really cool. So yeah, we, what, did we, what did we get? We got Gorilla Arms. We figured out a little bit more about Cyberware stuff. Caution. Um, and we got a bunch of stuff done. So I think uh, I think this is a pretty good episode. And I'm generally happy. Uh, I'm happy to be back in the game. I'm happy that it's not lagging like crazy anymore. Uh, I'm happy that they fixed it eventually. And I'm actually having a lot of fun. I can actually go around the city. I can enjoy myself. And um, now that I'm getting more into the game again, um, I'm actually really enjoying it. And I want to see how these gorilla arms pan out in the next episode because I'm going to see if I can maybe melee some of the enemies. Um, so we'll see. We'll see. It seems promising. It seems promising. So, yeah, I'm really, really happy. Thank you for watching. Uh, I think we're going to leave it there. So yeah, thank you for watching, uh, like and subscribe, all that stuff you've been watching. Uh, as I said, if you're any of my friends watching, that's awesome as well. And yeah, I'm really enjoying getting back into this game. Like, uh, it's been a few weeks, but it's smooth now. Issue's been fixed, and I can play it. So that's all I really, really care about. So I'm really, really happy. Uh, and yeah, so thank you for watching, and uh, goodbye.